a decent sound on the violin, all you need to do is take the bow by itself, put it on the strings, just the weight of the bow, and then open and close the elbow joint. But what do most beginners do? They use their big muscles, upper arm and the shoulder, to move the bow like that. But what if we do want to add pressure to the strings? After all, we can't play with only the weight of the bow. If you use the big muscles in the arm, like many students do, to press the bow into the strings in an effort to get more sound, not only is this a waste of precious energy, but you're also not going to get a very good or consistent sound. But instead, if you use this rotation motion in the forearm, which is technically called pronation, and you use that motion to push the string down, not only is this going to give you greater control over the sound, but this is not going to interfere with the most basic back and forth motion of bow technique.